G'day viewers, today I'm going to discharge this Pry TV and clean out that muck around that anode cap there. I've noticed that this, you can see around that edge there, it's kind of been arcing and uh, making hissing noises and all that sort of stuff as you see in one of JD Oz's videos of his TV. You see it's got the moisture and stuff around it so I've got the discharge lead thickly insulated with a rubber screwdriver, a rubber handled screwdriver, the jumper lead clipped on like so, and the other end, I'll put that on this, yeah, it's, yeah. connect this like so up here, to ground which goes over, where is it, okay that's not ground here, in this case this isn't directly hooked up to the ground, I'll connect it to here, the metal part of the inner tube is actually ground in this one, so here, force this under like so, It's actually been sealed with glue. Oops, camera not in the right spot. Okay, if I can just. Okay, we're discharged. Okay, it looks like I'll have to redo that glue now. So, and there's a clip on this style. That's what that clip looks like on this style of flyback. It's got one of those clips, so you just push off with a screwdriver up like that and it'll pop off. So I'll have to get, oops, there's a bit of video. I'll have to scrap that glue off, clean it around, all around that hole, clean that cap out, make, make sure I polish it good and redo the glue, and we should be able to test fire it and that hissing should be gone. So, get this off me, looks like I need to scrape it for that, so. Okay, viewers, that's the progress so far. Start off with a standing off. There is it. There. Scrape the glue off as good as best as I could. The stuff that was left behind, just got a rag from the kerosene. Just thought I needed the really kerosene when I had. And that rag, soap and scrubbed, loosened the glue off. Then I got this dish, dry dish, washing it out dishwashing scour and scrubbed the tube with that and that removed all the excess off and polished it. Then I got that rag with some methylated spirits, polished off the kerosene residue. Then I got another dry one on then, or the other side of that in other words. Dried it up, polished it dry, they got the compressed air and blew that anode button out. Clean it right out and dry it out, and blew this out too to clean this out as best as I could so no moisture is in there. So now I'm going to add my glue. I'm just using some gasket cement, black seal it, that's good enough for this. So, yeah, it looks like the way this is designed, I have to fill that all around up around that edge of this, push it on there, and I thought to be extra, extra seal it, I put it around the outside too of this, smear it around to guarantee a nice good seal. So we'll do that and I'll see how it goes. Okay, success. I'll fill that cap up with glue, pop it back on, and that'll be extra safe. I'll put a bit around the outside, smear it around my finger. Alright, I'll just put some there, we'll start with this. Smear it around. A little bit more off the end there. Oops, I can't oh, right, the camera like this, but bear with me, folks. Oh, I've got one more there. Ah, it's hard to upright the camera hold one hand like this, I tell ya. you. Can, oh, oops, sorry about this, folks. I'm just trying to. There we go. And the sand goes over the side, so I obviously can't film that, so I'll show you when I'm finished. Shit when it's cold. Okay. Turns on quite nicely now. I get no black bar coming across the screen here, which fades away gradually as it warms up. I'm glad for that. Now I turn the trap that box on. I think this is the station I've tuned into, I'm not sure. I'll try zero. 
That's because of VCRU. Oh, there we go. It's got a 700 chin in tune. There we go. Regretted calling her appearance in the hay last week. Pictures are too bad, either. I've no motive here, nothing to gain, she said. Yeah, I'm a black Oops, woman who has and will always support good Fair causes, really, folks. especially oh, relating right. to Africa. Today, defence lawyers said that That's the calling color. of these well-known witnesses was a that cheap publicity yep. stunt, but the prosecution maintained Darkness, that the testimonies of these stars might help illuminate a link between Charles and Taylor treble. and the financing of a civil war. Okay. Up, a JetBlue flight attendant is facing seven years in Picture jail after good. a bizarre tarmac tirade in New York. He bailed out of the Target plane on the emergency slide after a passenger pushed his patients too Come far. Hello there in a bit. He's being called a little bit of slot wear and a cheat bit. I can veteran correct the colour a bit to make it not as bad. What a wild story. Yeah, Everybody is talking about this adjustment right in this thing. Bit fiddly. Shove it moment. It began when two female passengers that's, fought over space in the overhead compartment. You see a little bit of wear on the border here on the side. She started cursing and slammed the that's overhead. That's old, but there you go. On his head. As the plane taxied in, the passenger TV's became great. more agitated when she couldn't access her bag. And for 38-year-old yeah, Steve Slater, that was it. He grabbed the aircraft intercom and yeah, announced... Three months ago, I've recapped it. Me a blank blank. Just a cheap generic Thank thing. You. Adding, that's it. So you need to be aware of when you buy cheap boxes. Beers, they might the play up and they get and stuck on standby. That's the Keep first sign of aggressive. having bad capacitors. Everybody has a bad day. Yeah, and once you fix that capacitor, so you know, in this case I did, I got the storage right. to break up. You don't want to do it and get away. Clean and but the like shorting out or something in the picture. So I found there's more capacitors. Oops, camera's on off. More capacitors here that control the video part of the power circuit. There it was. I play a sim all. The whole lot in this part of the circuit. Yeah, that, that he the standby half, the place more of a good ones, the box has been good ever since. Friends say he'd been under stress, caring for a mother with cancer. There you go, there's your tuning. He's been a great neighbour, and coming back and forth, he takes care of his mother a lot. There's a couple of these little wheels that are fixed, too. But the spontaneous exit could earn Slater a one-way ticket to stick. seven years in jail. In the United States, Emma Dallymore, right, 10 News. Thank you for watching.